In our big digital world where bytes and algorithms rule, there's something mysterious called Bitcoin halving. But what is it and how will it affect technology? Hello everyone! Today we're talking about Bitcoin halving, a special event in the digital world. Let's find out what it is and how it changes technology. Understanding Bitcoin Halving Bitcoin halving is a special event that happens every four years in the world of digital money. Here's how it works. When people use computers to help Bitcoin grow and keep it safe, they get rewarded with new Bitcoins. But during Bitcoin halving, the reward they get gets cut in half. So if they used to get 10 new Bitcoins, now they only get 5. This might seem like a bad thing, but it's actually a clever plan. You see, there's a limit to how many Bitcoins can exist, just like there's a limit to how many slices of cake we can make. This limit is set at 21 million Bitcoins. By cutting the reward in half every 4 years, we make sure we don't run out of Bitcoins too quickly. Think of it like this. If we kept giving out the same amount of Bitcoins all the time, we'd use them all up too fast and they wouldn't be worth much. But by cutting the reward, we make sure there aren't too many Bitcoins flooding the market. This makes them more special and valuable, just like a rare toy or a shiny gem. How Bitcoin Halving Started Let's go back to 2012, a big year for cryptocurrency. That's when the first Bitcoin Halving happened. This event changed how people saw cryptocurrencies because miners, who create new bitcoins, saw their rewards cut in half. At that time, whenever someone mined a new block of bitcoins, they used to get 50 bitcoins as a reward. But after the halving, that reward became just 25 bitcoins for each new block. Then fast forward to 2016. On July 9th of that year, something similar happened again. It was the second bitcoin halving. This time, the reward for mining a new block got cut in half again, from 25 bitcoins down to 12.5 bitcoins. Now let's jump to more recent times, specifically 2020. On May 11th, the most recent bitcoin halving occurred. Once again, the reward for miners got slashed in half, this time from 12.5 bitcoins to just 6.25 bitcoins for each new block they mined. Looking ahead, we're expecting the next Bitcoin halving to happen around 2024. This event is causing a lot of excitement and guessing among tech fans everywhere. What will happen next? Well, during this upcoming event, it's expected that the reward for mining a new block will be halved once more, down to just 3.125 Bitcoins. This result is only based on the stats from the previous event, but we can't be sure yet. Bitcoin Halving's Impact on the Market When Bitcoin Halving happens, it means the reward for people who help make new Bitcoins gets cut in half. Imagine if you were getting $10 for doing a task and suddenly you start getting only $5 for the same job. That's what happens with Bitcoin miners during halving. Now this big change doesn't just affect the miners, it sends waves through the whole crypto world like when you drop a stone into a pond and see ripples spread out. Why does it matter to everyone? Well, because Bitcoin is like digital gold. People buy and trade it just like they do with gold, hoping its value will go up over time. So when the reward for making new Bitcoins gets cut in half, it makes people think. Some may feel like there will be fewer new Bitcoins, so they'll become more valuable. While others get worried in the sense that, with fewer rewards, maybe miners will sell their Bitcoins and the price will drop. This uncertainty creates a lot of excitement in the crypto market. It's like a big guessing game. Will the price of Bitcoin go up or will it go down after halving? Investors and traders watch closely, trying to predict what will happen next. Some might buy more Bitcoin, hoping its price will rise. Others might sell, fearing a drop in value. Everyone's trying to make the smartest move to protect their money or make a profit. But here's the thing. Nobody knows for sure what will happen. It's like trying to guess the weather. Sometimes you're right and sometimes you're wrong. So during Bitcoin halving, the whole crypto world holds its breath, waiting to see which way the wind will blow. Will it bring a surge in Bitcoin's price or will it bring a slump? Only time will tell. But one thing's for sure, it's a wild ride in the world of digital currency. Mining in the Bitcoin world, facing challenges and seeking solutions. In the world of Bitcoin, miners act like the superheroes who keep everything running smoothly. 
they work hard to solve complex puzzles and add new transactions to the blockchain, all while earning rewards for their efforts. But there's a twist. As time goes on, these rewards get smaller. It's similar to getting fewer candies for completing the same amount of work. This is because of something called Bitcoin halving, where the rewards for miners are cut in half every few years. Now imagine you're a miner. You used to get lots of Bitcoins as rewards for your work, but suddenly those rewards shrink. It's just like your allowance getting smaller without warning. This can be a big problem because mining requires a lot of energy and resources, and miners need to make enough money to cover these costs. So what do miners do when their rewards start to shrink? They get creative. They come up with new ways to mine more efficiently and make the most of their resources. Of course, you need to find new shortcuts to finish your homework faster. Miners might invest in better equipment that uses less energy and solves puzzles more quickly. They might also team up with other miners to pool their resources and increase their chances of earning rewards. If things get tough, you work together with your friends to solve a puzzle. Some miners might even move to places where energy is cheaper so they can save money on electricity costs. Innovation is the name of the game for miners. They're always looking for new ways to stay profitable and keep the Bitcoin network running smoothly. Of course, you need to constantly upgrade your gadgets to keep up with the latest technology trends. Bitcoin halving, a technological transformation. In simpler terms, Bitcoin halving isn't just about money, it's about how technology itself changes because of it. Let's break it down. Blockchain Scalability Blockchain is like a digital ledger where we make records of every Bitcoin transaction. But as more and more people use Bitcoin, this book gets thicker and slower to write in. Bitcoin halving makes us think about how to make this book faster and able to hold more transactions without getting slower. We need to find ways to make sure everyone can use Bitcoin easily, even if lots of people are using it at the same time. So when we talk about Bitcoin halving, we're also talking about finding ways to make blockchain work better for everyone. Energy consumption. Bitcoin mining uses a lot of energy, like when computers work hard to solve tricky math problems. With Bitcoin halving, people start to worry about using too much energy. They wonder if there's a better way to mine Bitcoin without using so much power. It's like trying to find a way to do the same job, but using less electricity. This is important because using less energy helps the environment and saves money. So people are thinking hard about how to make Bitcoin mining more efficient and eco-friendly. Decentralized Finance Decentralized finance, or DeFi, is about taking control away from big banks and giving it to everyone. With Bitcoin, people can send money directly to each other without needing a bank. This means no waiting for the bank to approve transactions or paying extra fees. Bitcoin halving makes people think about how this could make money fairer for everyone. Maybe one day, instead of using coins and bills, everyone will use Bitcoin to buy things. It's like a digital piggy bank that everyone can access. And because Bitcoin has a limited supply, it's like having a special toy that only a few people own, making it even more valuable. Bitcoin halving is also about how it could change the way we think about money and who controls it. One small change in Bitcoin can make big waves in how we think about technology and money. And that's what makes Bitcoin halving so important in the technology world. As Bitcoin halving nears, will it bring innovation or disruption in technology? Give us your comments below, like and subscribe to our channel to get more tech updates like this. Thanks for watching.